like that. All right. Yeah, that makes things a little easier. Oh, Not yeah. really. The way we had it set up, we were already seeing it. Yeah, I know. Oh, it has... Does it have the live preview now up there? Yeah, it's right there. OBS, there. stop updating! You're all sick of your shit. I am. Hello, everybody. Welcome to uh, Telltale Games of Walking Dead. One game of the year, 2013. It's a fantastic game. Great. Makes me cry. Literally, I cry every time I play this game. Can't yeah. help it. I guess we could just keep this open now. It looks like it. I mean, everybody's getting to see behind the scenes. Who dares message me? My brother? Who Boy, dares? eat shit. I don't got time for your... Shit Lord, talking nonsense. We don't got time for that either. All right, let's Ain't play. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right. So obviously, this boy is once again playing this game. Uh, nerdy he's, friend and I have already played. He's never the played. shit out of it. Keep the standard. You want the standard? I'm just reading it. Don't give, don't tell me my business. Just pick the standard. And then yes, start on episode one, a new day. Oh dear. So uh, like other Telltale games and other good games, this guy has not played them yet. Mm -hmm. You've been playing. I've played good games. It's just when it comes to Telltale, I've been living under a sheltered rock. We're gonna try and power through two episodes of this, which sucks because they're both pretty long episodes. But we gotta get at least two done so that we can squeeze in three in the next. The Walking drink. Deed. The Walking Dead. The Walking Deed. Did someone say Deed? Yes. So, uh, this did win Game of the Year in 2013. Yes, it did. Which was. You consider what's actually going on in this gameplay, and it's just like, God damn, really? But sure enough, and here's our protagonist, Lee Everett. Sitting in the back of a police car, what's he doing? Sheriff's right Department vehicle. I like this conversation. Well, I reckon you didn't do it, Dan. Know what they say about wrecking does it really matter nah not much you know i've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison Who knows how many. he's getting taken to prison now, because he's a I bad boy do. he's the bad boy in the band and every time don't just be silent you don't talk too much do you? just because the game tells you to that's boring Follows your case a little bit. You be in Macon, boy, and all. You're from Macon, then? That's it. You've got an opinion, then? Wouldn't say that. I go in for that. Fuck, this vape's kicking my ass today. What the fuck? They get set too high or something. They say you kill. That's a pretty busy police That's a pretty. Video. I got a nephew up at UTA. Beautiful Steve. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? Could you not talk about my wife, please? You ass. You want to know how I see it? Wow, there's a lot of shit going on. I got much choice? Sure don't. He picked up on that. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Fuck you. No. It's not worth it. <laughs> Don't yell at the cop. You could uh, highlight the radio, like go a little bit lower, right there. Did yeah. that seem important to you? All of it. That box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention, and you drive yourself crazy. There's some shit going down, man. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. That's fair. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He oh. was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. Oh, great. Turns it off. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. You want to watch where you're going? Him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to lap him otherwise. No, really. Watch so where you're going, please. Having Thank exhausted you. all his options, he starts crying. Does the Earth seem round to you? Mama, it's all a big mistake. 
It wasn't me. Yeah, it does. <laughs> so did he do it? it? <laughs> Man, <laughs> not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. Damn. He sits That's in my fuck. car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Hey, that sounds like foreshadowing. Well, I got another good one for oh you. shit. This one's a little bit less Oh fuck, dude, there's dude on the road. If I do say so. Watch out. This other Oh shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. That's a hell of a car accident. Man, we only got to see the inside of Ah, it's a weird perspective seeing it from the inside. Yeah. What the hell's happening? Oh well. Some, just that's a lot of blood. Just completely sunny to like just zombie Mardi Gras like that. Well, I imagine we've been out for a while, and then we're still kind of in and out of it. Oh, that didn't sound good. Gosh, gee, Willikers, Batman. If I didn't know Jeez. any better, I'd say it was a zombie apocalypse out there. Probably. Still cuffed up, and our leg is fucked up. Well, that cop's a zombie. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, shotgun. Hey, hey, officer. Hey, hey, hey. hey, hey officer. Are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. Uh, oh, there you go. Boom. Again. Third time's the charm. Nope. Fourth time's the charm. And don't tell me that shit. I, fuck, fuck, I need need to move forward. Like, actually. Move I forward. The control oh, stick. Okay. Myself out that window. Keep going. Oh, what a perspective. Well, that that could have been a pretty bad landing. I think he did all right there. Damn, what is this? That's a hell park? of a drop. Yeah, what is this, Jurassic Park? That's another <laughs> Telltale game. Oh. oh, yeah, we could do that one later. I've I never played that one, but I've seen it. I would love to do it. Use left stick to move along the car. Mo weep. Mo weep. Yeah. Mo weep. Well, that's it. I'm in the mood for Resident Evil now. Thank you very much. Well, he's got the gun. Looks empty. All right. Well, at least we have a gun. Wait, what are you doing? Easier to carry with these cups on. <laughs> really, There's man? A bullet right there. <clears throat> um, it's actually a shell. Uh, it's actually a mind your own business. There, I said it. Look at cop. The officer's shotgun is over there. Yeah, put the bullet in it. Yeah, put the shell in it. Then it'd be easier if there was a. Uh... <laughs> Oh my god, we're real? Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck me. Easier to carry with these cups on. You have oh the god. bullet! Yeah, you are the, Shell. You are yeah, the it's, dumbest it's not gonna work that way. You are the <laughs> dumbest human being on the planet right now, Elliot. It's just Lee. Just call him Lee. Mm, 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 mm. Your name's not Lee. It's not Lee. No. Okay. Whatever you say, Lee. Uh oh. Oh, is this gonna be. Oh shit, he's gonna jump up as we go first. Of course he is. Oh no, that's fine. This is Zombie, of course he is. Oh, come on! Damn it, Lee! Oh. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, them fingernails do not look healthy. Yeah, oh, my God, take off the other one. Hey, Lee. There you go. Officer. Oh, shit! Oh, she's a sizer! Back up, back up, back up! Back up. I'm backing up. What in the hell? Got that shotgun shell. Or, wait, you, you already have the shotgun. shell. Get the shotgun. The one shotgun. Oh, oh my Jesus god. Jesus, Lee. This is the most embarrassing I'm running away from oh, a zombie dude, I've panicking, ever witnessed. Okay? 
Uh, shoot, shoot. Just A, just A. Oh. Yeah. Well. Well then. That used to be a sheriff. Shotgun. He doesn't know the rules yet, man. Now play the role a little bit. <laughs> Clumsy fuck. Damn, that's a lot of zombies out of nowhere. Was that one just sitting there the whole time? Rotting. No doubt. I don't know why, but the game, like, performs exceptionally bad at this cutscene. It, yeah. This cutscene always fucks up. Come on, you walk like one. How come they can't be fooled by that? I'm much shot in the dead. Hey, made it. At least you can still climb a fence. Oh shit, they're gonna tear down that fence. What? Was there gunshots? I only have one headphone on, so I missed it. Yeah, those I guess, were other gunshots. Yeah, I guess it was to the right, and I just had the ear, that earphone off. Well, shit. Hey, a treehouse. Let's just live up there. For real. Oh, wait, no, our leg's fucked. We can't climb up. <laughs> Head for the house, I guess. I'll weep. I'll weep. It's just what it looks like. Mm hmm I wonder if anybody's home. I mean, probably not. I doubt it. I think they would have heard the clamoring of you out back and the horde of zombies pounding on the fence. Anybody home? We need a little help. I mean, I don't know what I would do, but I don't know if like I'd be pounding on doors or whatever. I think I would have headed for the street, but I mean his leg is kind of fucked. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Uh, yeah, good job, Lee. If they were thinking about shooting you before, they're probably not now. Ah. Hello. I'm not an intruder. I'm one of them. I'm not oh. an intruder. I just this looks like a bad house. situation altogether. <laughs> yes. Book. Hey. Oh, I got you, Nicorn. Oh, it's not even finished. You didn't even finish the grass. Uh, blood. That's a lot. Go to the answering machine. Yeah, do the answering machine. Is this the same actor well as Full Jin? So I didn't know that. An extra day. I knew he's Thank the same so guy as Bluebeard, but Clementine, and I, I didn't know he was Full Jin. But I mean, Full Jin's accent's so fucked that you have no hope of putting that together. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting Check dropped. the drawers and stuff. They're not letting us Do things, leave man. and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just... Leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 oh, a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. This 911. We love you. Oh, well, that's sad. Very sad. Daddy? Huh? Oh. 
Hello? Hello? Oh, you need to be quiet. <laughs> you need to not tell me what to do. <laughs> Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Astute observation. Don't slip on the blood, okay? God damn it. Oh my god, man. Bash is fucking headed too. Watch this shit. It was supposed to like get way closer to you before you got that off. Yeah, I'm sure. Head and head and head. Yeah. I think that would have killed you if you were any later on that. This is for being such a whore. This is for failing to watch over Cloud Time. This, this is, is for, for being, being a zombie. Stupid. This is because I just don't like you. That must have been Sandra. Ugh. My brother thinks your Wolf Among Us choices sucked. <laughs> I don't know. He, he got most of the town on his side still. He did all right, I think. Well, at least he didn't burn the tree. <laughs> he did burn the tree, but he, uh, he did I practically let, had to uh, beg him not to burn the tree, though. He made did the wrong choice it? in the first one, not saving the prince, but that was about it. I think you did okay. So yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think the choices are a little trickier in this game than I they are in Wolf Among Us. So. Yeah. Um, if you don't make the right choices, oh. you'll end up alone in the last oh, episode. Okay. And I don't want you doing that. Yeah, I didn't want you to tell them that. Listen. That's a little much. What should we do That's now? all I'm saying. They could be dead. They could just do hate you. we wait you. for the sun to go down, or do we leave now? Listen. We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. That sounds good. We can hide in my treehouse until then. It'll be a tough climb with this leg. Covered in blood, man. Stay close to me. Yeah, because he fell twice like an idiot. Oh, well, it's dark out. And now we're going for help. We're looking for help, and we're looking to help Clementine. Now, let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Just get on. Okay. Hey, Ray Gun. Okay. Hey. We'll move as fast as we can. Playing The Walking Dead this time. This game got game of the year. I can't stop saying that. It's just amazing. When you yeah. look at this and you go, this got game of the year? Well, fuck yeah, it did. Fuck yeah. It made people cry. It made people feel things deep down inside themselves that they didn't know they had. I had feelings. It was horrible. I didn't have feelings, but this game gave me feelings. <laughs> Beep boop robot Justin. Yeah, I used to just be all mechanical and shit, but this game gave me life. Gave me meaning. Gave me Clementine. And then every other game proceeded to not be as good. Whoa! Are we getting shot at? Yeah. The fuck? No, Clementine. No. I'm sure we're fine. Hey, can you not? Georgia State Patrol! Dude, he won't listen to that. I'll come quietly. There's a little girl here. Yeah, can you not shoot at us, please? Shit, you're not one of those things. 
Yeah, so can you not you shoot at us? Talk. Wait, why did you say you come quiet? You hear the law? I thought I was being arrested. Oh man, no shit. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> My name's Sean. Sean Green. This is Andre. Officer Mitchell. Did you see any of those things? One of them just got our buddy Chet. Oh no, not Chet. I like Chet. Why didn't you go during the day? You would have saved Chet. But you don't meet the officer if you do that. Did Skuma? Yeah. Is she outside again? Or is she still in here? She's in here. Probably went behind her. You hurt your leg pretty bad. Look, help us find the thing. That cat gets around. And we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's. Oh, there she is. High school. You should be able to fix your leg up too. I got tricked. Just some guy. Just move the control stick. Just some guy. Same guy? Yeah. She's alone? Right? That's what I said, not Chet. Whoever Jesus. you are, let's get a move on. We just want... Oh shit, it's, it's Chet! Chet! It's Chet! That was fast. Go, get to my car. It was fast. It was like a whole couple of hours. It's not that fast. Shoot him. Oh, come on. You can't just leave Chet! Run him over! No. Goodbye, Chet. We love you. We'll never forget Chet. Didn't even have the guts to kill the Chet. Why do you hate Chet? I don't hate this him. This cat is trying to escape. Just want to put him out of his misery. I was talking about Justin. He hates Chet, clearly. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's a Chet leader. Boy, this scene looks familiar. Being in the back of the car again. Right. Yeah, but this time have you're not getting arrested. Have you ever watched the TV shows? Huh? Have you ever watched The Walking Dead? Dead? Yeah. yeah. We're about to meet so Herschel. Met like a lot of people mm -hmm. from yes. Walking Dead. Take care of you two. Mm. High school. Well, we're never seeing him again. Yep. Yeah, no doubt. I think I Thank think we God do God never see him again. Dead. Thank God I you're really okay. Dead here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple. That's Herschel, by the way. Yeah. Before he got his limp. Well, they were more or less based off the comics. No, I know. The show was loosely based off the comics. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You brought a couple guests. We need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. Don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He's well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yeah. Yeah. It's not doing so good. Not gonna be loud. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You. Take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Okay, Herschel's gonna question you. Yes. Be careful is. what you tell him. Let's have a look. Yeah. This is swollen to hell. I can't tell. I got yeah, I like the comics. The comic style drawing makes it look uh it hurts like hell. I bet it does. What Watch did you your say language your name in front was? of the little girl. I didn't. Well, now's the time. For real? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. You just I'm gonna understand. bandage that like nothing else? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Uh, Say out of prison. <laughs> Home. Just uh, out for a drive. Well, he didn't buy that for a fucking second. Those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with, the girl? A police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of me. I'm an awful nice guy. House is filled up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there. I didn't catch your name, darling. 
Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Can't imagine what she's gonna be through. Find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. What happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. Well, at least Herschel's easier to convince. If you come in, Dad, if you come by during the day, he just doesn't give a fuck. It smells like manure. Manure. Manure? Like when a horse. School, but get off my computer! Why? She's been climbing on my tower. There's like this much space between the desk and the tower. Cats are liquid. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Poor kid. Meh, could be worse. At least she's got somebody. I love him. <laughs> He's having a baby. You think he was dreaming about Chet? No. Dreams of Chet. <laughs> <laughs> Chet without a shirt hey, on. Get up. It's like. Mm. Wimp, wimp, wimp. What an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not a dad. Stay asleep. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. Uh, all right. We better get going. Or we won't hear the end of it. That's Sounds my boy, good. Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Yeah. Oh, you missed the dodging or quacking line. Water off a duck's back, you know. That's a valuable treat, believe me. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Gotta check with Clementine. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've also got nice name to catch you. So the faster we get this fence up, the like better. Gotcha. I a fence. <laughs> yeah, well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool. Duck and I will hop to it. I wonder if Sean's ever going to regret that decision. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Yeah, you're right. You probably will never regret no. that. Sean will never regret letting Duck sit on the tractor. Yeah, it's not the most the big, heavy tractor. In the world, but it gets a job done. Uh, oh, hey okay. there. It's, it's just Kenny. Uh, oh, Kenny. No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? <laughs> what do you mean? I mean, in taking care of that little girl. You know How many of these are there? Are there three or four home? Walking Dead games? No. It's three, right? Okay. Would have liked one then. Four? Yeah. Damn. I've only played two. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots, and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat. I, I think guess. it was. You if that was the one that Telltale was working on halfway through, I think another company macro, picked it up and dolphin, finished it. Whatever's biting and paying, Katya wouldn't be wild about it. But I remember looking it up, but I don't. Bad. I didn't remember if it was the third game or a fourth one. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Maybe I'm wrong about that. Though. Maybe I'm misinforming the internet. We were coming back from visiting. Her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Kenny. Not even the death of your son? Kenny. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Yeah. Gonna memorialize that one. Yeah, not even the death of your See, son? Those two are getting along. Why do you think Duck is gonna die? 
They don't characterize people in games like this if the horrible isn't going to happen. I bet you money that duck I bet die. his innocence gets shattered, though. Uh, excuse me. Uh, you gotta drive it? Stop. There you go. Yeah. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill. I'm good. <laughs> uh, Lee so used to be a history teacher. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Whoa, his head. That was, <laughs> God, this, kid, this is like the worst out of all the Telltale games of just being randomly wonky. Yeah. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. Like, this is the first time they tried this graphic style, and it really fucking shows. It. This, it, just episode kid, one, I think. A boy. Of season just one. shot him right in the face. Damn. Damn. Oh, shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. You don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh, my kill counts yeah. at two, sir. This kid's currently at two. I'm two and oh. I could shoot one, maybe, if it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whoever's out there. I wonder if Herschel will ever come to regret How's that. How's your family? <laughs> my brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. I mean, look at Duck go. Sorry about your friend. Chet will be missed. Thanks. I appreciate it. Man. We already had a memorial for him and everything. I miss Chet already. We played, uh... <laughs> what's this song? A Thousand Candles in the Wind? Yeah. I think that's what that's called. How many hey, candles Lee. in the wind? Candles in the wind. I'm gonna go, uh... I, I always get it confused with the fucking... Whatever you want, um, man. The Parks and Recreation version. <laughs> Five thousand candles in the wind. Okay, and what Duck is happy. What? You How just you doing, Duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. Uh, I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Uh, Duck, if you could not drive the tractor like that, that'd be great. But yeah, like, don't turn it on, okay, dude? I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> hey, Herschel. Uh, just kind of standing here awkwardly. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Uh, got a ride. I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked it to boyfriend. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, my leg is fucked. This farm's a nice plot of land. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. Do you agree with that? Hell no. Was brought up to? Yes. Don't answer your for me, Lee. <laughs> Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife. No, no, no. I don't think she's up in Virginia. Sorry to hear it. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I'm being attacked. I was being attacked. She came to my rescue. Hmm. Uh-oh. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to be. That is a big thing in words, this game. <laughs> you're going to be in trouble. Oh, and I'd start checking the attitude of your friend. I'd start checking on your son. <laughs> and I'm not your friend, buddy. Oh, Jesus. Uh, okay, zombies. Oh, shit. Okay. M many zombies. Make a choice, quickly. Duck or Sean? You got no time. Sorry, Duck. What do you mean, sorry, Duck? You're saving Duck. Sorry, Sean. Oh! Detect him! Hit him harder! 
Okay, now hit him. Yeah, okay, we saved Doc. Okay, now let's go save Sean. Because this is the kind of game that lets you save both of them. Kenny, why? Oh, shit. Oh, that fence wasn't very good, Sean. You had one job. You deserved it. He had it coming. That sucks, bro. That one didn't have eyes. There's no way walkers can see without eyes, right? I don't know, it's never made any sense to me. Oof. Right, I we, think Sean may have regretted jump, having deck on, duck on the tractor. Yeah, he probably regrets that now. Get the fuck out of here! Damn. <laughs> don't tell me how to Sorry. live my life. Sorry! Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I did too. I thought I could hold both. Addict. Remember that next time you panic. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. Okay, for the record, you did make the correct choice here. Yeah, it's kind of sucky, but that was the correct choice. You got that ride to make it if you want it. You sound less than thrilled about that. Well, I mean, you just got kicked out. So. Yeah, but we helped save his son. He's upset that he got yelled at, and that he feels guilty. Listen, Sean shouldn't have been standing there. You're right. Also, how did they just sneak up on him? Do you think that they like, came through the corn like it's fucking dead by daylight? That's kind of a stretch. Still, though. This is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. Well, things don't seem to be too bad here. Seems pretty empty. Oh, never mind. <laughs> things are pretty fucked here. Drugs! At least, like, oh, I can get me some of that. <laughs> Look. Oh, yeah, that's probably a person. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Nope, that's a zombie. Oh, they sure look friendly. Fuck. And they just come out of the woodwork. He made noise. <laughs> Oh, well, good shot. Lady. Hey, it's Clem! Yeah! It sure is. Nice cameo, yeah? Oh, Glenn. Lock that shit up. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. Is that Maggie? Be dangerous. No. <laughs> Worse. They could have let him right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What about the what about the little boy? What is it? I I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids. Real, Clem. Really? Now it's not the time. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God yeah, damn that. it. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. And forever starts a Kenny that. versus Lily. Holy yeah, shit. for real. Kenny versus Lily is such a big One thing. Of them was he wasn't bit. He wasn't bit. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten shut up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, I wonder if I wonder if he'll ever regret saying that. <laughs> Dad, we kick his ass. It's no reason with him. No, kick his ass. No reason. You need to calm down. We reason with him. Oh, come on. Bloody end of an axe handle. <laughs> I never, I've never thought about the foreshadowing in this game. Shut up, Lily. 
And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here. I wonder if he's gonna regret things. having it being all worked up. He's bitten! That's how you turn! <laughs> he's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Sit down or else. Getting eaten alive. Sit down. You're gonna whoop me? You in one homo parade. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> That's good. Little boy, before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first dead. thing he'll do is sink his Seriously? His this guy's name Lenny? Larry? Then, I don't remember. Dead, he'll probably pounce on your just a deal boy. with it. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? Don't be an uncontrollable man either. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. No. Don't touch that boy. Don't touch anybody. I've got a little girl I'm trying to. Too. You want to get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better I like Lee when he's pissed. Because it's me before anyone else in here! <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, fuck! That's bad. <laughs> I wonder if Lee's gonna slip. God damn it, Lee. <laughs> Always does. It's like, his, it's like his character trait is slipping. Really? Oh, on your feet. Good shot. Carly's a good shot. You okay? Just great, thanks. Oh shit. Guys. Clem will remember you protected her. I'm not sure if there's an option not to protect her there. Clementine probably pissed her pants. So did that guy. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. Yeah, that sounds like a helicopter or some kind. We almost died because of this old crotchety fuck and his screaming. <laughs> I told him to calm down. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? Up it's yours. Mm. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the farm since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. We'll do it somehow. Get through the office. It's probably the entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Educated guess. What the Doesn't fuck matter. else would it be? We need nitroglycerin pills. A house? Please get in <laughs> there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. <laughs> you know your way around? Local. Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie to get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got Also, we don't know if anybody else is tuned into the same frequency, so What's good luck. Name? It's Lily. It's not like they can Dad. check about that. Keep a good eye on Lily and Larry. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Okay. Them two need to stop looking like they're up to something. Lily and Larry? Yeah, that's pretty common. 
You're a pretty good shot. Pretty good shot so far. The reporter, especially Ugh. one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. There's also um some granola bars in here that you can give to people. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about Ugh. five feet away from me. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but you know. Yeah. Yeah. You don't really deserve that just for being an asshole, though. That guy saved you. Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps are. Ghouls or whatever the hell they are, they were pulling. Where to go with zombies? How come nobody just fucking says zombies? Nobody in this whole series. Walkers or geeks or deadheads or whatever, but not just fucking zombies. I think Larry said it. We drove up to cover the cherry blossom festival. It's a real hard. I think Larry said zombies in this game. Yeah, I'm working on it. What are you messing around with there? A radio. The foreshadowing though. What the fuck? It turned itself on, it wasn't me. Spending my goddamn money? Spending Stop. more of your goddamn Stop. money. <laughs> there's no batteries. Uh, there's no batteries. What now? You know how batteries work? Yeah, of course. Stupid yeah. idiot. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. Are you taking my armrest? What, yes. what is this shit? I'm taking your armrest, it's mine. This is like some movie theater fucking airplane sitting shit going on here. Hi, Skooma. Do you want to get out? Purpose yeah, that's a yes. Nothing, nothing. All right, bye, Skooma. I love you. Step outside, have a look around. <laughs> but not suicidal yet. No, the gate up there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Huh. Oh, huh? Okay. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary noises. Good call. Damn, there's like machine gun fire, there's grenades, there's a helicopter overhead. Somebody's sweeping through the area. I mean, that's what would be happening in the first couple days. Military would still be functioning for a while. I think. Oh, Jesus. They just eat. As far as I can tell, yeah. Get you. Hey, you. Whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? Good question. I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. You know, there's one thing about. There's one thing that I. Oh, really? We're gonna go. No, nope, hold on. Wait. Look around. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job. Related to Lee. Do you know that guy? He has a familiar face. Could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. He's also, you know, my brother. No. Could be anybody. You know, they start rotting and cheek up. Shut up, dog. Hey, Kodiak. Which one of us is the is the zombie in this situation? And if I was the zombie, would you kill me? He could have worked at the drug Cody asked my brother by the way. With keys in his I I'd shoot you. Take a lot of I wasn't asking you. I'm just saying. Just inserting myself. He says into he it. says I'm the older one, so I'm Lee. <laughs> oh, so then it's painful. And full of tears. It has a really, really sad ending. Oh well, at least you don't get pinned under a tower and probably get munched on by fucking zombies. Fucking electrical ones, man. They just get, they just get all the real G's. <laughs> Seriously, how does that electrical pole fall on him? Was he like on it? Do you think, like climbing up it, and then it got torn down? Is there a car nearby? What did tear that pole down? Uh. Look at the look at the pole. I want to I want to see what tore it down. It looks like. Maybe a car hit it and then left? Perhaps. That's kind of what it looks like. 
There's really nothing else you can do right now. You need to have a way to get them pharmacy keys, but I don't. Oh, uh, there, there is a brick on the floor, but you can't do anything with that yet. Yeah, not yet. Uh, that's the family. And not you in it for some reason. I think there's pictures with him in it. I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Is, is that a joke, Lee? Is that, are you fucking kidding? A little bit. That's one battery. This fucking guy, right? Can you need another one. can't let anything happen to Ducky. Oh, yeah, check in with them. You should talk to him. Hey, Lee. Really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway. We, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Are you guys all right? We're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? I don't think that's gonna be a thing. They own this place. Which is the truth. They uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah. They did. Probably. I mean, you know your brother's dead. He's okay. It was just a shock. You're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Okay. How's she doing? Lydia has this, like... She still has to pee. Uncomfortable smile. I don't think she has to pee after what she went through. Her family's dead, so... But Lee gets this uncomfortable oh, smile sometimes. Yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. She's just a little girl, okay? Lee says she spent days on her own. That takes toughness. But you have no idea what sort of emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Sure. So. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? I mean, I tried to save him. You left. <laughs> I don't know if you remember what happened, Kenny. Kill ourselves. We killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice of killing Charles. You think you do when you look back on it, but in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. Lee, yes. oh God, he goes back and forth from being like. Try to let it go. Kenny will remember your loyalty. He goes back and forth between being like almost creepy to being like grizzled as fuck. <laughs> weird character. I don't hate him, but weird. What's that? It's a granola bar. Energy, energy bar. bar. Whatever. I don't see a difference. They taste just and the there's same. There's plenty of difference, okay? <laughs> they're, they taste just the same. I had some granola protein bars. Don't make bars me give you some good. covalescent aids. Oh, alive, alive inside. inside. He's like, oh, I doubt it. <laughs> oh, okay, all right, there we go. No longer alive yeah, inside. Yeah, that doesn't look like alive inside, yo. Uh... Oh, hi, Clem. Coming with me on this adventure? Adventure to see my dead parents? <laughs> dead parents. I can't think about them in here. Oh, why not? It seems like all you're going to be able to think about, bud. This door leads to the back alley. First aid kit. There you go. Uh, I don't think we need it, though. Our legs still patched up. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Okay. Uh, hey, Glenn. Are you are, are your shoes like soaked now in your pee? Oh well, there it is. That's the family. Find anything? A 
photo of the family who owned the place. It's just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. Fuck. Oh wow, that nearly <laughs> Man, you really you suck at telling lies. Who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I'm sticking to first stage for a reason. What the... What is that moment? Like okay guy. The last thing we need is drama. <laughs> they try to like have moments of tension like you do in movies and stuff where you like look they like look each other in the eye or whatever but then Lee's eyes go oh. Good. Cuz if this lasts longer than a few days and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I'll just keep it to myself. I'd say thank you. How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. Oh, I've got options, bitch. Hi. You're gonna find out about my options pretty soon. You just let Clementine know the truth. That's fine. It's so crazy that this is still episode one and we're already like all the way through Lee's like backstory. Okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplift his women. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you would have. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. Yeah. Good night, Raygun. I ought to clear a Yo, path to Ray Gun's taking off. Say good night. Good night, Raygun. Yeah, good night, Ray. Better get this door clear. Can I help? He's deaf to the world with his headphones on all the way. Yeah. <laughs> sure. That's why I leave one Here headphone off. Watch your fingers on the doors. <laughs> Things have been scary, huh? How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything inside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Cross your eyes. It'll get stronger that way. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Uh... Well... Do your parents do? At least you got all the time Let's in the world. Just move this thing. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. Well, don't make her feel bad. Jerk. Alright. Jerk first. butt. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they like hate you? I hope not. I wouldn't blame. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things were. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk to each other. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ow! Oh no! Oh god, right down the I fingernail! Finger. Is it bleeding? A little. Luckily we know where our first aid kit is. Yeah, luckily we know where our first aid kit is. One band-aid. Is not what press. What? Excuse me? It's the remote to my dad's TV. I'm sick of your shit game. 
and I'm sick of that too. That's not what I'm aiming at. At least we got the remote. Let's have a look at that. Thing. We actually do need that. <laughs> oh. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Band-aid. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. That is what? Okay. <laughs> Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find us. Lee? They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. That's so true. Close to me to okay. It's too bad we took the other one. There's a TV on the top corner. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find tools for Larry in there. But we need the keys. That's the door to the pharmacy. Still, still need the keys. That's actually, what I was looking at. But you okay, can't, you can't look game. at the cane. It's not up to you. Dad told me he bought that TV to watch baseball in here, but I caught him watching his stories more than a few times. That's what I figured. You didn't even press the power button. How do you know that remote it doesn't have its power button like right It's here. always listen. the red button. It's not always. It's listen. always. It's not it's always. Always. Listen, always. I'm always. sick of your, I'm I'm sick your eyes. Not in a little while. It's always. Everyone out there seem all right to me. Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah. Can you do that for more? Well, of course. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Oh, so innocent. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Come on, Clem. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Bad, right? I am. Uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? You might want to be honest with her here. No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. So it never 100% explains it, but the backstory of Lee is that, um, Somebody was sleeping with his wife, and he killed that person. Yeah, they covered that. Anchor. They, yeah, they... They covered that. Well enough, That's I guess, like yeah. the cliff notes. That's all we need to know. Ooh, another energy bar. Yeah, right there on the left. Where? The left. No, don't give her one. It's not much, but Damn it. Here. Are you sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't. There's another How's one. It doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily, my dad's Larry. Yeah, uh, I hear a uh, bitch and asshole. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad it didn't help. Yeah, like he didn't get in everyone's face. He was gonna try and kill the kid. What was I supposed to do? Let him? Bitch. Stuck a bitch. Roberts, Ugly stuck up bitch. I know. I'm... No, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UTA. Was anyone, Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wet. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Oh! Oh, that feels bad. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? We were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. Makes sense. Feels bad. I think I'm gonna go now. Yeah. <laughs> think about all this. What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. Uh, not exactly Jesus. Okay, it's a little little different than Jesus. I think, I think, uh, you know, Jesus would be like, this is outside my purview. Now that I remember, hey Dan there. This is Glenn, and, uh, I'm kinda in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? 
This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah. How do you get stuck? I saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones had to jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a job. Those motherfuckers better not make me do... It's either Glenn or Carly, because motherfucker... Ugh. Ah, uh, no, nothing like that. Another energy bar. You should probably feed your... Uh... Protégé. You sandwich him. This place didn't get looted. Yeah. Uh, it looks pretty looted, friend. Feed, feed Clementine. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Or they took the donations. Central High Tech State. Papers will be gone. Feels like years. Well, I got one battery. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. That's one. I think the other one's in the middle. Like, you gotta go all the way around to where Clementine is. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. It, it's in the it, but it's in the middle. <laughs> it's it's right. Keep in going. There. Keep going. Keep going. I don't know. I'm looking. Down there it is. There. Yeah, there you go. And give Clementine some food for God's sake. You got another energy bar. You got like three. I got two. Two. That's plenty. Feed Clementine. Not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. You took care of Clementine. And maybe Carly gets the last one. We are about to leave. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to and work And another now. one. And another one. And another one. We just hand her like 15 yeah. batteries. We'll find it some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and water. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. What is she, like a dog? <laughs> fed and watered? Uh, see about the radio now that's got batteries. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look. Because I'm not a fucking idiot. <laughs> some, Twenty bucks says this is something stupid. I bet she put. The, I bet she put the batteries in wrong. I bet that we've played this before. Oh yeah. Look at that. Women, am I right? Hey. <laughs> Fun fact: I put the batteries wrong in my vape almost every time. <laughs> Yeah, and I have to fix it every time. I think you have to put up that antenna, too. You fixed it. I guess not. Look at Lee just standing The is okay. Steve. What is that creepy smile? That radio sign off didn't sound too good. You okay? God. I'm fine. Really? Everyone's dead. Right then. We don't need to talk about it. Thanks. What? There's nothing I can do now anyway. Really? You aren't going to ease her down gently? Carly noticed your concern. Concern? One minute it was like, hey, are you okay? And then it's like, no, 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 okay. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I'm not angry. Yeah. Are you angry? Yeah, exactly. That was very <laughs> odd. Alright, let's go help Doug. Let's go help uh, I'm glad it'll be fine. He'll sit, he'll sit tight until you get, get here. It's Do we have to talk to him to go back out? No, you have yes. to talk to You have, to, talk you to, have to talk to him to go back out the front part, but you have to talk to Carly to go to the motor end. Alright, then let's go to the motor end then. Hey there. It's a creepy smile. Well, don't you have to get those Ooh. pills? Fuck the pills. Larry will wait. Okay. Better get back to it. We'd rather just yep. get the pills because I'm here now. 
But we got Don't a mention big it. problem. Just remember what I said. Yeah. I will. Yeah. yeah remember, sassy bitch. remember how batteries work. Bitch. How are we doing? <laughs> uh, excuse me. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yeah, let's have let's a look, look around. around. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna solve this for you. There's a brick on the ground. Grab it. Uh, Do the combination lock. No, I, you can't, because you don't have the comb. Oh. I thought he used the brick what to break the it. What is for? Oh, yeah, it's perfect. Hey, man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Oh, well, we have a... Show Doug the picture? Yeah, show Doug the picture. So that he knows that that's an employee? That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? Found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we could make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there. Throwing the back, perhaps? Be long, right? mm -mm. I think you do have to go to the motor in first. Maybe there's a way to distract him and buy you some time. Can't reach that break. Um, go to the left. No. Glenn did. Man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. <laughs> Look to the left. No, Glenn had it because he left, closed left, it before. Left, 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 that. Use your remote TV. on that. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Just hope the power is still on. You could just do that? What the fuck? I memorized all the codes for this TV. What? <laughs> he memorized all the codes for the Universal Remote TVs? He looks like the type that would. Well, Jesus. Done, Doug. All that dark nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already has it? But they can't hear it very well. So it's not distracting them. I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. We need to break that window with the brick. But I don't remember how to get the brick. Can't reach that brick. Try the brick again. Maybe he'll just grab it now. Can't reach that brick. Why? Look where it's at. You could totally fucking reach the brick. Yeah. I don't see why you You couldn't. do have to open the damn thing first. Well, which Doug, means we need to go socks with sandals? That's almost criminal. I'm going to feed you to the guys myself. <laughs> Let's head uh, back inside. Yeah. Okay. Because what's the fucking point? Hate people that do that. I think this is going to take three streams because you're not very far into this. And no. the second episode is All right, we got to go save Glenn because he is the one who locked it in the first place, so he's got the combination. Maybe. No, there is no maybe. Yeah. When we were running in here, he closed it and locked it. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. I love how when we go outside to check, and it's super quiet. But when we're in there walking around talking to everybody, there's a helicopter. Well, shit, that was close. Oof. Okay, zombies. So you have to do this in a very precise uh, order. Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Be ready to not shoot. Guys. Oh, man. Glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right, that wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trap in there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. Then, up there in the corner of the room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to give him an help, but she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when these guys came out of the forest. A couple of us got me. I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. Really? You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her. With or without you. Think about it if it was you. Fine. 
Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Hmm. Do we have a weapon or anything? That's a weapon. That's a fire axe. That's a lovely little device. Might be our best friend, even. What? But you don't want to be seen. This is actually a moment where you could fail. Yeah, this game has a lot more fail states than The Wolf Among Us did. Big time. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly, noise attracts these things. Let's have a look around. So I think it's... Peek over the wall. But as the screen gets red, it's more dangerous. We can hide by that RV. Don't do it yet. You gotta make sure the coast is clear. I uh, can I look oh, around? Oh, pillow. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply I might have an idea for it. Really? Yeah, you, it's can, a pillow. you, you can use it as a. Uh, I know that. Obviously, we played muffler. the game, but I'm just. Well, you didn't grab the pillow. think about that. If we go to the right, that puts us right under the stairwell. But yep. I'm more interested in that axe. Then go for the axe. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you do the thing here. There's one back there. I'm trying to get into a room. But I didn't see anyone actually in there. That's everything I know, man. But, you know, watch out. Really? Could you use the pillow on him? Well, one pillow and two corpses. An age-old problem. Huh? Well, they didn't let you do that. Well, All right. Let's, I think we're gonna have to head back over that way. Yep. Let's try to go talk to Carly again. No, no just go to the right. As much as I want to let you just figure this out, we really don't have time for that. We really don't. Just make a decision, damn it. Just, so just run over to the truck. Oh my god, I'm trying to talk to Glenn, but whatever. No, no don't, don't. Talk. Just the truck. Yeah. Into that room. All right. Now, uh, pillow that zombie that's right there to your left. Yep. That one. Get out your gun. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. Jeez. They made the zombies look real fucked in here. Yeah. But I mean, that's how they look in the comics. Okay, so is there anything in the car that we can use now? There's a broken window. Look at that. Spark plug. Cool. Grab that and go back to the truck. Anything else of use in here? Nope. Oh, yeah. Try to do this. Spark plug. You should hold on. Can we push it now? No, I think you need to... No, go back. Go back to the truck. Yeah, go to the truck. That, that thing at the bottom, the bumper says shit happens. <laughs> and now, uh, I guess look at it? How are you looking at it? So the, look to the right, I guess. You need to look in the truck and examine that there's something in there. I don't know how to get him to do it, though. Okay, there you go. There's an ice pick. Use the spark plug. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Inside these things, turns cold into tissue. 
That's actually true. Isn't that insane? What the fuck? Like, how does that work? I didn't know that. Yeah. Isn't that fucked? That, that's weird. Look up a video of that shit. Okay, so now you got a decent weapon, so go back to that car and, uh... I, no, actually, I think you need to run back and kill that one first. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. So go to the left and then kill that one with the ice pick. Ice pick? That's what it is, right? I thought it's it, an ice pick. Oh, okay. It looks like a screwdriver. I thought that's even what it said. <laughs> oh, God, that's fucking useful. All right, now go back to the right. Hell yeah. Oh no, can you kill this one with the ice pick? Yep, okay. I'll wait for it to get closer. What? Why the fuck would you stab him in the chest? Panic move. Okay, so now they're all go to the car. Quit, and then we're gonna use the car. Yep. The, now that the car is not on, like it's on neutral now, go ahead and push the vehicle. Yeah. There you go. Now you had it. Oh, the damn camera views. There you go. Yep. Oh my god! You fucked me up. Holy shit, dude. Scramble his fucking brain. Get him. Hey. I want that. Oh. Dude, where'd your weapon go? <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Much too use, much more useful. Lee's axe. You've got my axe! <laughs> that should help. Big time. Now, up the stairwell. That the one the right there, that one. Yeah, those are the stairs. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay. We'll be right behind you. But yeah, I just said not to do that. Lee has uh killed way more zombies than these guys did. That's so true. Far. I think Carly's got a... She's got a kill count of two so far. A similar two, kill count. three. That we've seen? I, I only count like two or three. I'm just saying she does okay. And Lee's only killed like five or six. It's not that big of a difference. Kill! Just hit... Buttons. There you go. There you go. Yeah, it wasn't giving me the oh, option until gotcha. just then. Yeah, just one same thing. Oh, that's sick. Rad. <laughs> Indeed, Glenn. Keep a hold of that eye, Glenn. <laughs> <laughs> I get it! We're here to help. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. She's in trouble. Miss, we're coming in. Chop this door down. We just ruined her fortifications, but fuck it. But fuck it. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh god. Oh, I, she's I dead. I said stay away. But we need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Oh, I wasted all this fucking time for no reason. Fine. Won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die, and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Good God. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. 
you had a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me? I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please. Hey, that's not very Christian either. That's also a good point, though. Yeah. Give it to her. Give her the gun. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. You made a no. difficult choice. Then shoot her. Then shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like, and it's coming back as one of those things. Shoot her. Help her out here. You're insane. Just take this thing. You're the one who didn't want to give her the damn. Just hand her the gun, for real. Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? Why not? I want the fucking gun because back. Somebody needs to pick up the gun. You can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. Man, that is just a difficult choice. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you too. Oh god, that's so fucked. Yeah. Hi in the woods. Ooh. We just helped this girl kill herself. Chicken liver tastes good. I agree. She does agree. She's eating gizzards and stuff like all the time. She, yes. never, she never shuts up about her it's gizzards. Fucking good. Dude, when Thanksgiving comes around. <laughs> It's so good when you fry them up with lots of like salt and pepper. Right? Mm. Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine. Chicken liver. <laughs> okay. I've got a few cans of gas in here. Picking up the truck in the car. Good to hear it. And things back here. Why? Our friend is still in and out. We won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. All right. Now we head outside. Glenn Cause should, now you got the axe. Yeah, Glenn should come with us. Oh no, you do have to use the axe on the combination lock, I think. How you doing, man? You know. But you still needed it. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it. Have to. Chicken okay. liver and warm coke. That's what I had for dinner. Back at the motor. Back at the motor. How can it be that bad hmm. so fast? You know when things. That sounds. That uh, sounds like a very interesting combination. Like, like I would a, want a cold. A good cold old. Uh, that sounds like a college dinner. I mean, I'll drink soda even if it's warm. If I have to, you know what I mean. But you if I can, if I got like a half hour to pop it in the freezer. The gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? She didn't. She was it. dead anyway. All but nothing like that. It was over for. You better hope you're never. <laughs> What's your next you better hope you're oh. never bitten then. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I. I. Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Don't worry, you'll get badass soon enough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. And then that maniac's gonna smash your fucking head in with a bat. I've seen this TV show. I'll be back. By the counter? Okay. I would talk to Clementine. Didn't I would. You say you'd no. give her back the walkie-talkie? No, fuck it. Get, get out there. You're a dick. Yeah, that lady was infected and she wanted to die, so we like convinced Carly to give her a gun so that she could shoot herself in the head because zombie virus hey there. excuses uh, suicide. Kind of does. Can I get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Stick. Yeah, it wasn't much. I know, but I'll see if I can find something else for you. There's plenty of food like all over the place. We should get to know each other. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being being good, good is good. good. Despite the circumstances. Yep. You're making no yep. sense, Lee. Right? Like, what is that? Just a monologue of the century. <laughs> Brilliant and conversation. Sister, I had okay. a half a can of whipped cream. Are you good? 
Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, I'm good too. You're good. Are you sure yeah, you're good? You good? Good is good. Are you good? I, I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm fine. Good, I'm good. Are, good. are you guys well, that's good? That's good. Good. All right, cool. Are you good? As, as long as we're Maybe good. Maybe I'm a little good. hungry. Me too. Let's have some chicken liver. How are we doing? <laughs> good. Get the emergency <laughs> rations out. <laughs> Whole bag. <laughs> it's just he's shaking it. No, it's not a bag. Around. It's just a liver. <laughs> like you just. Okay. <laughs> it's not even that big. A liver's like this big. Okay, so just axe the shit out of that. My ass makes awesome. Chernobyl look like a tea Not party. <laughs> Carefully. Get that beer. Are you fucking serious? He's gotta, oh yeah, he's gotta, my open. He's gotta God. open it a little bit. Just a tidbit. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, that's, oh, that's, that's, that's a little too much, Lee. Yeah, nice and loud, too. Good. Mm. Feeling exposed yet? I can reach that brick now. What that? Yeah. Okay. Ridiculous. Now, break that window. Break that window like it's your god given birthright. Yeah. Brick smash window! Ugh. Oh god, I don't like looking at that even in like this weird. Yeah, I know. Static is like. Oof. Oh man. Zombies are like, oh, I fucking love this show! <laughs> oh, look at them like. Look at them in tandem, like humping that building. Like, yeah, they are. These like four. But, like, actually, at the window, it was like, Undelena, Undelena. <laughs> Be careful. Don't tell me how to live my life, Doug. Alright. You gotta kill your brother. Yep. Hey, bud. <laughs> younger brother or older? This is younger brother. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. And keep your fucking voice down. For Are real? you seriously yelling across this zombie infested street? I got to do this now, man. I got to do this. Oh, it's so sad. It is. All right, give him the axe. Oh god, it, was it wasn't even enough to kill him. Oh, he didn't hit the head. One more. Just aim for the head, Lee. Jesus. Give it another. Jesus. Christ. Are you fucking serious, Lee? Keep going. Thank you. That was five chops too many. Yeah. Four chops too many, but yeah. Get, just get the keys. Oh god, that is so fucked. There we go. Holy crap! Run! A way to keep a fucking eye out. Man, they thanks just... for opening your fucking gob. Damn it! How many jobs do? Close it properly now. So we have to break the lock off. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. The zombies love Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Damn it. I've got the keys. <gasps> Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. Yeah, let's get in there. Nothing bad's gonna happen if we try and go in there right now. Nothing yeah, bad nothing at all. bad at all. Nothing bad at all. You know what I don't get? Why does this alarm go off? Oh, you you opened it with a key. What exactly? Really? Like what defense mechanism? It's bullshit, right? I'm not it crazy. Is. Like you you went you opened it with a key. Like wouldn't the door be the sensor? You know. At least just got a screwdriver hanging out there. Doesn't that hurt? So you know that's fine. I'm just saving it for later. It's my trophy. Up to seventy percent off. Um, let me swing by my place and see if we can't get it a hundred percent off. She got flies buzzing. God, what the hell is this? Raccoon City all of a sudden? Kind of. Well, pretty much. There's your police station. <laughs> 
in the form of a pharmacy. Maybe time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Why is that door not locked anymore? Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Well, shit. from the windows. Uh, they, they need you in the back. Oh, they need Glenn in the back. What? We don't make it through this. You should know that I think you're a great guy. Oh, don't do that to Doug, me. shut up! Thanks, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. Oh, shit. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. No, this isn't good. Oh, bad, fuck. bad, bad. Are you sure? Shit. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh well, that works. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Oh what do you shit! Think she grabs. Did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. That window Seems like she has an idea. Okay, Doug, go handle the window. And now that we've successfully separated both of our companions to either side of the pharmacy, I wonder what's gonna happen next. B. Oh. I found something. Oh, the stick. Oh, what a good girl. Okay. Dad, protecting this store one last time. Yeah. But not that guy. Fuck that guy. <laughs> oh, shit. Who are you going to defend? Yeah. The woman with the gun. <laughs> but Doug helped with this nerdy shit. You have to make a choice. Yeah, I'm protecting the woman with the gun. I'm sorry, Doug. God, it's 100%. Sorry, Doug. Gets dragged oh. out of the street and everything. Oh my God. Carly was like crushing on him and everything, Let's and we just let him die. Oh, yeah. it feels bad. Had to make a choice. Oh, shit, Clementine! Thank fuck no. God. Fuck the fucking hell no. You get the fuck off of my kid. I don't care if she's not really mine. I'll crush your fucking head in, bitch. And I'll take your screwdriver while I'm at it. No, I guess I won't. Oh, what? what the fuck, Larry? What? Well, way to show your appreciation, dick. There's a zombie coming. Oh, Kenny. Oh, oh, well. Oh, thank fuck, Kenny. Fuck yes, Kenny, thank you. Oh, we need to go. Okay, bye. Wow. What the fuck was all that about? He We're, will tell you all about it. We are not going to talk about this. You went back to the motel. I mean, we cleared it out. It's the goodest place as any. Fucking asshole. I just got you pills and that's how you thank me, you son of a bitch? For real! Yeah, I know. What a fucker. Oh, yeah, that dead girl's in that pile, too. Yeah. See her right there. No, I saw her. her. Ace Pizza. <laughs> he was the pizza guy. Pizza delivery boy. This is a long ass beginning chapter, man. Mm -hmm. I think we do need to stop after this. It sucks, but we're probably going to have to do an extra stream to do all of these. We started really late, and I want to try and do two chapters on the next one, and then we'll finish it up on the last one. Yeah, mm -hmm. this is such a good one. We can't just, we, we will not stop this one. <sighs> Well, we're definitely playing all the way through this game. Oh, we'll play all fucking four of them. <laughs> oh, God. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening here. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Fuck off, Lily.
You and your dad could go fuck yourselves. Really? Yeah, they're really... Should she just teleport over there? I don't know. She fucking did! Find your friends. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect it. You guys be safe. I gotta go back into the city so that way I can run into Rick. Mm -hmm. This is the only chapter in the game where you meet anyone else from like the series. Oh, of course. I don't even know if it happens. You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. I'm gonna go in the city, get attacked by zombies, and then a sheriff is gonna find me, and then we're gonna start our own group, and we're gonna survive. It feels Trump. like a thousand seasons. This, this show is not going to really get any better. It'll get a little bit worse, but people will keep watching it anyway, and then uh, I'll get my fucking like, head smashed Like, you know, in. I'm going to be honest. When they started introducing Negan, I was so bored. I was I, uh, I was, I pretty, was already checking out. I was pretty out. done after the governor. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I was somewhat no done after the whole... Take care of each other. They were living at the prison, which was cool. Yeah. But then once that scene know, was over, know. I was just done. Clementine, I mean. Earlier, All I gotta say, though, clues. Glenn and his wife, Maggie, though, I look at Whew, so much sex. Guy, he figures things <laughs> out. The girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Really? Thanks, Kenny. Seriously. You don't expect Kenny to be, like, your best friend in this, but he really fucking pulls Kenny, through. Kenny's he great. really does. Yeah, because Kenny is a, is a properly raised southern boy. You don't leave no man behind. Oh, well, you're gonna find out just how southern he is in the next episode. Yeah, you are. <laughs> now, I'm not talking Alabama, you know, but... Is he burma I'm talking Florida. <laughs> I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I Yeah, I don't think so. Pretty fast. I know, it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, then... Well, you you're should've... single. I'm sorry, come on. It's okay. Thanks, though. Did you just call There's me a car? A in the past few days. Anyway... Yeah, sorry. It's like, it's who, do you save? who do you Coral. save? The awkward guy who used to, who knew stuff about Wait. technology, or the chick with the gun? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Mm. I was gonna help you both. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. Because you had the wish gun. We both made it, you know. You had a gun, that's why. Yeah, you had a gun. They they could come. Didn't in even give me that option. They could though. come in pretty handy. Check in on everyone. Yeah. Let's get that. This is how this wraps up. Oh, fuck you, man. We're gonna talk to him in a second. Toast. You know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then. Hey, duck. You wanna cool it for a minute? Okay. Sorry. At least he could take a clue. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> no, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Oh. Glenn had the other one. Oh shit! I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Oh, I'll find you another one. That's really sad. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Go fuck yourself, go Larry. Yeah. Oh, man. Clementine. Another thing. Oh, my God, man. <laughs> like my daughter? Hell no. No. What? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Her dad tried to kill me. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. Oh, shit. So will everyone else if you go near her. Were you planning on sleeping with my wife? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Yeah, I'll watch your ass. Watch your ass, watch your ass have a heart attack, attack you buddy. fuck. Hey, Lee. Tell you what, we'll have a fucking scar of Mufasa sacrifice if you pull that sanctimonious shit. I'll long live the king your ass off a clip with a heartbeat. Because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. 
We're lucky to have you. So is her dad yelling at us the game's way saying, Oh, potential love interest right here. No. Uh, oh, that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. I mean, you could try. Motor ends pretty well, damn I would recommend it. It's basically Lock Lily versus Kenny. So do you want to be friends with Kenny or do you want to be with Lily? Until the military rolls through. Kenny, right? Like, I obviously. I actually agree with that plan. <laughs> Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, your power right. goes out. You know, guys, that I would be hilarious. <laughs> right after he just said it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think it's going to be okay. Said everything. Oh, look at it! Every it episode. all went out. Well, like, oh fuck. shit! And Clem comes running. <laughs> and that's the end of episode one. Oh. Uh, I think I think we dumb, get a pr little preview dumb, here. Uh, Let's actually pay attention to this. Next time on The Walking Dead. <laughs> I thought we'd be fun if it was about the walkers. I never expected they'd stop us out. We're having food That's problems. That's kind of what they do. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't know me when you come. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We no. gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. Oh, I'm Andrew St. John. Shit. We're from the St. John Dairy. So we you meet some people. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry as much as the bandits. Bandits? Oh shit! Who the fuck is that? There's too many of them! Ow. You never liked my dad. Get back at the drugstore whenever you thought Kenny's Correct. No more, please. No more, please. Please, please. Oh. Episode two, starved for help. Oof. Mm -mm -mm. But we're not gonna play that tonight. Yeah. Because it is late as fuck. It's very late, and that chapter is very long. But let's look at these things. Uh. You and 63% of players were honest with Herschel. Who Shouldn't would you honest. save? You and 49% of players chose Looks Duck. Looks like we're in the minority there, but barely. Just, just barely. Same with, the, same with like the other child. child. It's like, whatever. The kid Side has a Kenny. longer life to live. That you guy's life is near its end. You and 48 players defended Kenny. Uh, that that whole scene was kind of like wonky. Like, you mm -hmm. try if you try to be reasonable, you're automatically siding with Philly. Like, it's bullshit. You almost did, too. Like, at the beginning, you were kind of siding with Lily, and then you were just immediately like, well, no, no, gave fuck Irene this guy. Gave gun? You and 45% of players gave her the gun. Who wouldn't give her the gun? For real. Pressing start. Would you save Doug or Carly? You and 76% of people chose Carly. Okay. All right, I guess that's it for right now. Based on the comic book. Well, I mean, they're, the comic book's based on the... Oof. I mean, the TV show is based on the comic book as well. But, yeah. Loosely All right. based off the comic book. We hope you've enjoyed this uh, stream. I'm sorry it's a bit of a short one. We started pretty late. We uh, were doing something before this, so we kind of had to, you know, start late. Yeah. But Th thanks everybody for watching. If you liked what you see, leave a like, follow, check out our YouTube channel, No Lives Left, where all of our Twitch stuff gets archived. Um, and be sure to subscribe over there as well. Thanks again for watching. And hit the we'll bell. Hit the bell. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye for, Bye now. for now. And thanks for the follow. Don't think I didn't see that. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, we all do. I do the most, though. Yeah, he does. Oh, uh-uh. Yeah, huh? Nuh-uh. Yeah, huh?